The New Mexico Attorney General Hector Valderas is investigating New Mexico House Majority Leader Cheryl Williams Stapleton. She's accused of money laundering, receiving illegal kickbacks, and violations of the Governmental Conduct Act, as well as racketeering. Law enforcement agents executed search warrants at her home and business this morning. Stapleton worked with the Albuquerque Public Schools since 1984, and according to the search warrant, she was associated with the company Robotics Management Learning Systems, LLC, which was awarded more than $5 million in contracts by the district over the last 15 years. The search warrant also showed that she is also directly involved with four companies that received payments from the robotics company. Evidence suggests that she was paid at least 60% of what the school district paid robotics management, totaling nearly $1 million. Investigators are looking into additional payments that were redirected into her personal bank accounts. Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham issued the following statement following reports about those allegations. It reads, quote, I am deeply, deeply troubled by the reports this morning about a law enforcement investigation into Rep. Stapleton. People are innocent until proven otherwise, and I know investigators will follow the facts wherever they lead. I await more information, like all New Mexicans. But I will say that public confidence in government is seriously damaged by even the appearance of imp impropriety or illegal activity, which is why public officials must always hold themselves to the highest possible standard of behavior. New Mexicans expect and deserve elected officials who, regardless of party, will put the people before themselves. Anything less violates a sacred public trust and must be dealt with accordingly.